Well, thank you, Amber. This week's Lost Creek Care and Rehabilitation food segment involves a recipe that will do more than just fill your stomach, but will also flush out a lot of things we don't want in our stomachs. All right, Trudy, so you've got us here on set. <laughs> I want to start, I think the first step before we even get into it should be renaming this recipe because it's, it's called the Liver Cleanse Recipe Gentle Cleanse. It's not exactly, it hasn't enticed me. <laughs> when, they, when they said we're going to do a liver cleanse recipe, I thought, uh... <laughs> well, obviously no. this is your first time. So we this have is to, my first we time. We have to be gentle on your first time to make sure you understand what you're doing. And you're okay. going to feel so much better after you do this, Zach. Okay, I'm going to refer to it as the sunrise sparkling fruit juice drink that kind of helps your liver. That will, that will con anyone into drinking it. <laughs> Sunrise sparkling. Very good. Yeah. Very good. And that's because we have these sunny that's lemons right. that we're, we're going to be doing. That's right. All right. So take us through it. Let's start. What do we have here on set with us? All right. First of all, it's very important to understand that a couple times a year we need to cleanse our livers. And it's a very gentle process. You do not have to fast. It's one of those things where the liver is it's a very smart organ. It's the largest organ in our body. Hmm. It weighs about three pounds. It's oh. located right underneath your liver, or underneath your rib cage, um, on your right side. And its main job is to purify what is coming in and out of your body. Okay. So toxins and chemicals and preservatives that we take in every day, and the and what we drink, what we eat, what the air we breathe has lots and lots of chemicals mm. in it. Mm. So this, by doing this a couple of times a year, you will clean your liver out. It'll, that helps build your immune system. It, um, if those people who find that their uh, liver enzymes are high, a little liver cleanse will lower those numbers down. Mm. It's great for people who have a little bit of gallbladder attack. Mm. It'll help mm. um, eliminate those gallstones out of your gallbladder. And what it does, it, it forms bile, which is a green soapy uh, substance that shoots from the liver into the gallbladder and then helps us to form our stools. What that bile does, it captures all the toxins and pulls it out through your system. Oh, okay. wow. So it's really important that we do this. This one is a, a recipe that you're supposed to do it three days in a row. Now, however, if you have some chronic health issues, you've never done a cleanse before, you wanna check with your doctor first hmm. to make sure that they're okay with that. And you also wanna maybe go more gently. If you've cleansed before or you're in excellent health, you can do this three days without any problems. If not, maybe you want to do it one day a week for three weeks okay. as opposed to three days in yeah. a row. It's a more gentle approach to making that happen. Okay. All right. So now how do we do that? First of all, we start with apple juice or cranberry. Off to organic. a good start. I like there apple juice. There we go. One yeah. cup. Do we put this, you want this in the blender? Yes, we're going to go ahead okay. and do that as we do. Cut this here. And while we're getting ready for the next things, we need to have two lemons, and you need freshly squeezed. I've already done one, so we'll go ahead and squeeze the other half of that. Okay. And at the same time while we're doing that, I'm going to ask Zach to put one tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil. Well, I don't, we don't have a tablespoon on set here with us, so <laughs> we're trusting my kitchen abilities to gauge a Just tablespoon. Just eyeball it there. Ooh. You guys can say stop. Okay. Uh, uh, that's good. That's good. That's very good. I just put three tablespoons. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Extra cleansing. That's Extra right. cleansing going on there. My wife would be much better at this than I would. But. All right. So go ahead go and dump that in there. In there. In this. And how much, how much lemon juice was this? That's juice of two lemons. Okay. Then next we have our wonderful ginger root. Mm. And this ginger root uh, will help also with the process of cleansing. It's great for your stomach also if you have an upset stomach, ginger roots to do it. You peel off a half an inch and you take the little bark off of this and you chop up in pieces and you throw that into the blender. Okay. We'll pass that over. Next will be a clove of garlic. Now I want to make sure people understand this is a clove, <laughs> this is a bulb. You don't put the whole bulb in there or you will not be oh, able wow. to drink it. It's a good thing you did not ask me to put the, and the one uh, time, garlic One time in. on TV, Andy, <laughs> Andy ate garlic on <gasps> television. He had never oh. done it before, and I can, I can only tell you what it smelled like yeah. around here. It was he had to eat a bunch of blueberries pretty afterwards. Pretty bad. <laughs> and next, all right, so we take the garlic, the garlic you smash that garlic, make I sure that you release all the wonderful enzymes in there. Throw that in there. It smells good. Oh, also. you can Were hardly you supposed to wait. smash the garlic. I did. I smashed oh, it in smashed advance. It. Oh, good. We're already I smashed. Smell the, and ready the apple to juice. Go. So. And we make sure we put a cup of, of spring uh, distilled or spring or reverse osmosis water okay. into okay. that. And I think that that's everything that we have to do here. So All one right. more time quickly, that was? One cup organic fruit juice, apple, works, or cranberry. Okay. And you're also then gonna do two 
squeeze lemons, mm -hmm. a half an inch of ginger peel first. You're going to take one cup of distilled or spring water, one tablespoon virgin olive oil, okay. and you put that all in your blender. All right, this all right. I can do, I think. Are we ready? Okay, you ready? Okay, here we go. Oh, looks good. It, does, it's, it looks all right. It smells now. <laughs> How long are we going? Just till it's just till it's blended. Okay. Okay. Well, you all know, right. it doesn't look it looks that like bad there. A nice smoothie fruity type. smoothie. Yeah. That's what you tell yourself. Fruity smoothie. And now, there's is this best to take at a certain time of day? You or? should do this first thing in the morning on an empty stomach. Okay. It makes about two cups. And you do have to work your way through that. So give yourself plenty of time through the day, to just uh, in the morning, to drink through. You need both of those cups to 16 ounces for your breakfast. Both of these. So it makes 16 ounces, and you need to drink the whole thing mm. to be able to get the whole benefit of the lever cleanse. All righty. Maybe we can okay. see. <laughs> Are you ready? Cheers! All right, here we go. To your Why liver. Not? To, to your liver. Newly healthy li to liver. To a better immune system. To feeling good, taking your pain away, getting rid of toxins. I think this is very palatable. Well, it is. The lemon mm. with the apple juice. The lemon, you can definitely tell. Yes. Mm -hmm. but yeah. the, the apple juice sweetens it up just a little bit. Mm -hmm. And with just a little bit of the garlic, not the whole bulb, <laughs> you can really get that down. It might be ginger. a little oily, but that could be my part. <laughs> <laughs> well, a measuring that's, spoon could help that's in, right. in these. It's things. actually very good. I, I could drink this mm -hmm. in the morning. Mm -hmm. And then the only thing sometimes are side effects that with this may be is that is called a healing crisis. If you all of a sudden just feel like you're coming down with a cold, Cold, or you're mm. just a little more sluggish. It's just the toxins are now being cleansed out of your body. Ah. That's a good sign. All right. Hmm. All right. Well, you know, this may be something we have to do regularly here on the Faith and Friends. Cleanse our livers together. Andy and Mark have no idea what they're doing. <laughs> soon, soon. All right. We're going to throw it back to Amber to tell us a little bit more about some special programming coming up on WTLW.